Cody gets here, give yourself up. Try not to get too close to him. But look, I... Don't argue. Do what I tell you. Don't move. Drop your gun. Where's Graber? flying suit under control just before I crashed, but I'd lost my gun. When I tried to look for Graber and his pal, they had disappeared. They must have taken off to the hills on foot. So where are we now? About back where we started. Except that we do know that Graber's been hanging out at Al's Cafe. They'll probably never show up there again. But I might find somebody around there who knows them. Anyway, I'm going to give it a try. I'll call you later. Sure, I've seen him around here and talked to him a few times, but I don't know anything about him. What did you talk to him about? Well, I'm a mechanic, and the last time they asked me to do some work on a truck motor for him, I couldn't handle the job, so yesterday it was. I told him to try Benson's over on the south side of town, but I don't know whether they ever went over there or not. Mm-hmm. I'll check up on that. Do you know Benson's address? It's on Central between 14th and 15th, south side of the street. Mm-hmm. Good. Thanks. I'll let you know if they ever turn up here again, Mr. Cody. Good. See you later. Frog, are we ready? the new ray gun ready to mount in a well camouflaged truck, Your Excellency, and are prepared to renew our campaign. Good. What are your first objectives? Since the authorities here learned of your planned invasion from the moon, there have been heavy troop movements in this area. We plan to concentrate on destroying troop trains. Very well. Work as fast as possible. We must have Earth's defenses completely disorganized before we start our invasion from the moon. Yes, Your Excellency. Everything ready? Yes. We can pick up the truck and get going. Here are the timetables. The map with the best points of attack indicated. Cover as many of them as you can today. Right. No, I don't remember anyone answering that description. But of course, we run a lot of jobs through here, and I don't know all the drivers. How about these trucks that are in here now? Well, this one and this one are a couple of my regular customers. That one's a cross-country job. It came in last night for an ignition check. I didn't see who the driver was. The night man took care of it. OK, if I look it over? Sure, go ahead. Get away from that truck. Hey, what's going on? Frisco. Stay out of this or you'll get hurt. Now, look, I don't want any trouble in here. Let's roll. 
That truckload of radios was a phony. That whole back end was a fake door. I'm sure they're planning on hiding something inside. Probably a ray gun. That's what I'm afraid of. They'll probably start blasting again any time now. I've sent Ted out to the airport to stand by on a plane with some light bombs. As soon as we hear of any ray gun attacks, I'll fly out and try to locate that truck, then radio Ted to bomb it. Cody Laboratory. All right, we'll be right out. They just blasted a troop train in the east end of Carson Valley. Radio Ted to take off on our plane at once and fly around out there. I'll contact him as soon as I spot the truck. Right away. Calling Ted Richards. Calling Ted Richards. Like he's coming. 
close, but drop down a little lower next time. Okay. Get going. 